Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm the Count of Gold Goddess. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. I hope everyone is having a day of just trying to make it. I'm also having a day of just trying to make it. For today's topic, subject title is going to be on, it's going to be about, it's going to be titled Life is a Book. Life is like a novel. So, for this week, I'm going to be making videos talking about life. Yesterday, I made a video saying that life is a movie. For today, I'm going to talk and explain how life is a book. Life is a novel. And we're the author of our own life story. We're writing our own book. We're the main character in our book, in our novel. And we're writing how our life is going to go. Like for me, in my novel, I'm the author, and in my novel, I'm writing myself as an entrepreneur. I'm self-employed. Like right now, I'm trying to really get, I'm trying to get my online business started because I'm on YouTube, on TikTok, Instagram, and and Facebook. I'm trying to get my online businesses started on those social media platforms and then I do Grubhub. I'm doing Grubhub and Uber Eats. I'm doing food delivery until my businesses pick up and take off on social media. Yeah, I'm trying to be a social media influencer. But right now, I have to do, I have to do food delivery. I have to make money and take care of myself until my businesses on all these social media platforms just take off and I can't wait until the day happens I'd be so excited and ecstatic when it happens so I'm just hoping and waiting I got faith and I, I believe in myself even when I'm not seeing results I'm still not doubting I'm still believing and I know I got this I know that I'm going to make it I know that I'm going to win and I'm going to succeed and keep pushing through until until I get to the finish line. I'm going to finish hard and strong. But I know it's not going to be easy. And I tell any of y'all, if y'all want to be a social media influencer, want to do online businesses or do online marketing, then get started. There's no, there's no right time. Just get started. You don't have to have all the answers. And you don't need all the knowledge and need to know everything. All you got to do is just get started. Just get started. And everything, it'll come to you as you get started. Your research, you'll read about your craft, and you will learn more and more and more. And it'll start coming to you. It will just start coming to you. Soon it's going to be a second hand. Like second nature. But it's not easy. I'm not going to lie. It's not easy. It's a hard road. It's a long road. And you got to be consistent. You got to stay on your grind. You got to stay on your hustle. Like me, I'm, I'm grinding and I'm hustling. I'm hustling and bustling. <laughs> if that makes sense. I just round those two words together. My silly self. But I like being funny. It's good to have a sense of humor and laugh sometimes. Because all the stress in this world and this evil matrix and the evil rulers of this matrix it wants to break down your vibration and frequency. It wants you to feel bad upset and sad so i laugh at times laughter is a good medicine it's good for the soul and i have a good sense of humor <laughs> i like being silly and goofy at times to make myself feel better to brighten and lively up my day and to brighten and lively up my mood so in the theme of my novel of my storybook about my life about me as the main character I'm just working. 
I'm being a workaholic. I'm putting in all the work that I want. That's the theme and plot of my story, is I'm putting in all this hard work and being a workaholic and working so hard and just striving to succeed. I'm striving and striving and striving for the best and in the end result. And the end of my novel and the end of my storybook, I'm going to be where I want to be at. I'm going to accomplish all of my goals. I'm going to be successful. Success is going to be written all over my face. I'm going to reach all my dreams, goals, and desires that I'm not going to be able to hide it. And success is going to be written all over my face. <laughs> it's going to be written all over me. I'm, I'm going to be successful and prosperous and living out the life that I always wanted. I'm going to be living out the reality that I set and made up for myself. My reality is already in existence. I just got to put in the action and the work to bring it into my orbit, to bring it to myself to bring it into my presence and to be me. My reality is already set. I just gotta keep working hard. I gotta keep striving and keep going. I can't give up. I will not give up. I'm not a quitter. Quitters fail and I'm not a quitter. So I'm not going to fail. I'm not going to fail. I'm going to succeed. It's like, it's like failure is not an option. It's like I got that killer instinct in me to be successful and prosperous. Because it's that killer instinct in me that I have to make it. I'm either going to make it or die trying. There's no plan B. There's only plan A. And it's me making it or die trying. If, it's no if ands or buts about it I got to even if things don't work out in the long run because things can be out of our control and out of our reach a lot of times so even if everything doesn't line up right in my destiny and in my life of how I want it to be even if everything doesn't manifest how I want it to be I, at least I can say. At least I can say that I tried. If things to manifest totally all the way, like I wished and hoped, at least I can say I tried. I can say that I put my best foot in. I can say I gave it my best effort. I gave it my all. I can say I put all my eggs in that basket. At least I can say that. I tried. At least I can go out with a bang and said that I gave it a shot. I can say that I'm going out with a bang and I gave it a shot. I gave it all that I could. I put all my blood, sweat, and tears in it. I had the killer instinct. I had that adrenaline in my blood. I had the warrior nature. I had the warrior spirit. So at least at least I can say that. At least I can say that I tried until I could not try no more. And I tried <laughs> I tried it to the end. Either that or I'm gonna make it. And for now, even, even if I don't manifest everything, I know that I'm gonna manifest some things of what I want. Because the outstanding factors that are stopping us. So if I can't manifest everything, I know that I'm going to manifest some things or what I want. Throughout my life, I'm going to manifest some things because I'm getting closer. I'm getting closer to achieving all my dreams, goals, and desires. I can feel it all in my bones. I can feel it in my bones. I can feel it shut up in my bones. I can feel it inside of me. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. I made a video talking about this. I can feel it. I can feel it. It's close. I know it seems so far away, but... But it seems so close to it seems reachable it seems attainable and i got this i got this in my favor i got this in the bag 
I got this in my hand. I got this. I got this. I got this. So that's my. So that's the storybook of my life. And I'm the author. That's how I'm writing my book. As being my own author. That's how my story is going. And that's how it's going to end. That's my theme. And my plot and my settings. Of the storybook and the novel of my life. Because life is a book. Life is a novel. Life is a storybook about your life. About you. So think about your storybook. And set, the, and set the tone, the settings, the plot and theme. Have you been an author of your story life? How you, of how you want your story to go now, of how it's going now, how it's going to end, or how you want it to end. So think about that. Think and ponder on it and think about it. Okay, I got to go. I'm Mikhail. Like, comment, share, subscribe. One love. Bye, and this I get them out. It's your girl Mikkel. Until next time, I'll see you. One love, whole love, for love.